Hola beauties! Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Morenigia and today, as you can see from the title, I'm going to be reviewing the Balaterazzi by Beauty Blender. This girly rat her. And yeah, okay. So, it's $20. Let me just say that off the bat. It's $20. $20. $20 is a lot of money to blot when you could just use your favorite powder blotting paper. I have a blotting paper from BH Cosmetics that's literally I paid a dollar for it so I don't know it's up to you but I'm gonna review it off the bat it smells really good it smells like the Beauty Blender uh, solid cleanser it's a nice scent almost like lavender I guess so good and it comes with a mirror I like that it comes with a mirror and it's just to peel off let me see if it's a good mirror Oh yeah, okay, it's a really good mirror. Oh my gosh, I can see everything. Okay, so yeah, it comes with a really good mirror and it comes with two of these bad girls. And this little, oh, it says don't toss me. Okay, I won't toss you. <laughs> it comes with another guy back here. It smells just as good. I'm gonna put the separator back in. Um, and the back, it's like insulated almost it looks like. And on the back it says, blot larger areas with the wider side of the egg shape and smaller areas with the thinner side. Clean with, okay, yeah. Clean with the blender cleanser. And it says, uh, this is important because I didn't even know this, it says to use dry. Okay, that makes sense. I thought that I was going to have to wet this like a regular beauty blender and then blot. So I like that I can't use it dry because I was like, man, that's a lot. So I'm glad that they put that there because I was about to wet this. I'll take you guys along with me. I'm not oily right now, like I'm just applying my makeup or I just finished applying my makeup. So I'll take you guys along with me, and if I get oily throughout the day, I'll blot and show you guys what's good. So yeah, so on the website though, it said to press, pause, and then lift. I mean, that's how you blot, so. But I guess maybe some people don't know how to blot. And it also said that it's shaped to fit all contours of the face. So I guess the larger size you use like, and then the pointier side you use around your nose, I don't know. We're gonna see if it's worth it, honestly. like. I blot with my fancy blotting powder. It's amazing, you guys. And I also blot with those little sheets from BH Cosmetics. And the Neutrogena ones are really good, too. If you are in the market for a good um, blotting paper, the Neutrogena ones, the blue ones, amazing. They're just kind of pricey. And I went through them really fast, especially when I was in high school. So, but they're really good, though. I promise they're so so good I guess I can give you guys like my first like real impression of it though just from this it's this container is like a really hard plastic like this is definitely durable so I like that like $20 okay they actually made the thing good like it looks like good craftsmanship I do like how unique it is the compact the little egg shape the mirror is really pretty this is a hygienic separator, I'm assuming, because it says don't toss me. Um, so yeah, so we'll see if it is worth it. We'll see if it actually does what it's supposed to do. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. Okay, I am back. It is basically the end of the day. It's almost 8 o'clock, and as you can see, I am an oil slick, especially like right here. And usually I get really oily above my brow. Oh, I'm kind of oily. Above my brows and the middle of my forehead. My chin is not oily at all, which is weird. But Alright, so we're going to really put this Blotterazzi to the test. Okay. Let's see. Okay, so I've just done the side of my nose, and is the oil gone? Yes. Is my makeup gone? Yes. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that, but my makeup's like right there and right there. Um, when I use my blotting sheet, my makeup doesn't really come off. So, and if it does, it's just like a tiny, tiny bit. So that's kind of troublesome. Okay, so I'm just gonna continue to blot the rest of my face. Oh, 
Okay, so I blotted the rest of my face. Um, this is what it's looking like. Like it's definitely oil-free now. Though my makeup is definitely done. My makeup is like, take me off. But um, I don't think it's worth twenty dollars. I don't know. I just there's a lot of my foundation on here. I don't know if you guys are seeing this. And I feel like with my blotting sheets, it just doesn't take off that much. Like it, it, because my blotting sheets are white from BH Cosmetics, and I can see like if it comes off. Only like a little bit comes off. So, one thing I do like about this is when I was blotting above my eyebrow, like I, I was kind of like pressing it into my brow, and oh, well, actually, no, that's a lie. Just got him. Okay. I thought I liked that, but guess I didn't. <laughs> guess I don't. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so no, I don't like this product at all. I think it's just really gimmicky. They're just trying to use like uh, the Beauty Blender name to get people to buy the Blatterazzi. Um, yeah. Am I gonna return it? No, cause I'm just like I'm not one of those people that likes returning makeup like that. But am I gonna use it again? Probably not like it really took off a lot of my nose makeup and I thought it wasn't gonna take off my brow makeup like I thought when I um, blotted it didn't take any off but then I just did now and it definitely did that is definitely my brow so yeah I don't know I am so sad I, I wish I could have liked it because the mirror in this guy is really cute the mirror is amazing I may just carry it around for the mirror so yeah Maybe it would be good to like touch up like under eye concealer. Okay, no. I'm trying to make it work. I'm trying to find like a use for it, but no, no. I'll probably just end up using these as like just a regular sponge to help like blend in whatever. But I, if I were you guys, I would not waste the $20. Please don't waste your money purchasing the Blatterazzi, it makes no sense, it's really gimmicky, doesn't work, takes off your makeup when you're blotting, don't purchase. I hate to be so like blunt with it, but it's true, it just, it did not work. Like I mean, it took off the oil, don't get me wrong, but I feel like your blotting, your blotting paper, the point of it is to blot off excess oil and not actually take off the makeup. But as always, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video if you like this video. And yeah, love you guys. Besitos. Bye.